Walking Crow for the Transformational Sacred Drum Medicine saying Happy Moon Day to you. Thank you, Great Spirit. Thank you, Great Mother. Thank you, Power and the Guidance of the Medicine Wheel and all her relations. Hey, thank you, brothers and sisters. Thank you for coming this beautiful, beautiful Monday, Moon Day. Aho, aho, aho. So today, I was going to do a, a, a video and talk about some things. I made a list of things that I want to do uh, talks about. But uh, it sup was superseded by Spirit. And Spirit wants to know, is duty the reason to be grateful? Are you grateful through duty? Or are you grateful because you're grateful? Or are you grateful because you're godful? Are you grateful um, uh, because other people are looking at you? And you may not be so grateful. Aho, I always say, and it's been my quote, Gratitude is a daily investment. My daily investment of gratitude is for walking crow. It's not for you. It's not for anybody else. The things that I wish on myself, I want for myself, and that's how I move forward. I live in daily gratitude. I was an asthmatic, so I am grateful for breath. I know that water is first medicine, so I am grateful to, for a drink of water. I know that fire transforms, so I am grateful to the fire for my esteemed self, a whole. And I am grateful for the air, the wind that blows through my body, a whole. I'm grateful for the earth that I stand on, which allows me to be a whole. Aho, what are you grateful for? Are there things in your life you're grateful for? Or are you just a puppet and mouth and parrot like a lot of people in this world? Sorry, not sorry. They, they parrot what they hear and they say what they hear, but they don't really feel what they mean. Aho, shinawana, aho, nada, aho, shinawana, hey. Thursday is, is uh, Thanksgiving. And why wait for Thursday to be grateful? I'm grateful every day. I live in my skin. My skin is healthy. My body's healthy. My voice is healthy. My eyes are healthy. Everything about me is healthy. My spiritual nature is healthy. And I nurture the nature of who and what I am and who and what I have always been walking crow. Aho mitakwayasin. Aho mitakwayasin. Aho mitakwayasin. All my relations. All my relations. All my relations. Aho. So, um, what are you grateful for? Are you grateful because you have something to eat? Are you grateful because you have a job? Are you grateful because you're still getting unemployment and you don't want to work and all of that? Or are you grateful because your eyes open today to a new day, moon day, aho, to a new breath on moon day, to a new love on moon day, to a new being on moon day? There is so much more that you don't see, that, that we don't see, that we are not even, not even aware in the awareness of, because we're in the awareness of our cell phone, our coffee, our computer, our car, our next appointment, everything else but the things that come to us naturally. Aho. 
Are you naturally in your nature? Are you grateful for the natural nature of who and what you are and who and what you do? Hey. I just sat for two hours, uh, a beautiful uh, lunch meeting with my friend Angela. Uh, and uh, we talked about, we talk about everything. We talk about relationships, people in our lives, friendships. We talk about business. We talk about our lovers, our non-lovers. We talk about all those things, all the things we're grateful for. And I love being able to, to speak with somebody who mirrors the things that, that I understand. A whole, a whole, a whole. Uh, what is it that you want for yourself? What is it that you want from somebody else? Um, do you want something from somebody else so you can have, so you can be, so you can do? Do you... Uh, are you a spiritual person that lives in, and works in Sedona and actually does spiritual work? Or are you somebody that wants to, um, you know, grab onto somebody's coattails and get dragged along that way? Find your space, find your will, find your ganas. Ganas is um, uh, uh, um, uh, Spanish for willingness. Willingness, your ganas. Que, tien, que ganas tienes? What ganas, what willingness do you have? Are you willing? Cool. So, t I just got home and I'm sitting on my patio, and I wanted to have a Wild Horse Mesa as my backdrop. But if I face the camera the other way, all you see is dark me, dark, and you don't see anything behind me. So the reflection behind me is actually from my my a sliding glass door, so you can see my background. Hey, I hope. So um, uh, Thursday is Thanksgiving. I'm grateful every day. Uh, why do we need one day a year? Uh, to be grateful, uh, to express gratitude when we're and when we're in 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 gratitude. Oh, um, it's like people. Those, there are those who go to church every year at Christmas or Christmas Eve, but they they don't pay God no attention any other time unless they need something, unless somebody's dying or somebody has cancer or somebody's sick. It's the only time people have time for God when they want something, right? And uh, uh, and is God great? And if you speak that God is great, it, does that show up in your behavior all the time? Aho, you know, is is God your God? And while you're wearing a T-shirt that states that you know, my my favorite car, my favorite motorcycle, my favorite this, my favorite that, but not your favorite God. Aho, I love the Hindi. The Hindi, you know, uh, they're different uh, deities. They 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 honor them. Aho, in America we honor the deity of I don't know what, who knows what. Honor the deity un, unseen of spirit. Oh, that's the deity that I honor. I honor my spirit, my God. What does that look like? I don't know what it looks like. But sometimes it looks like me. Sometimes it looks like you. Sometimes it looks like my friend Angela. Sometimes it looks like my friend um, uh, Christine. Oh, sometimes it looks like her dog, Boo Boo. It looks like different things to different people in different ways. I'm not uh, wanting to talk bad of people. That's not my, my intention. My intention is to ask you, what is your duty? What do you, what do you play, give duty to? And does duty deserve that? I owe myself everything that I owe myself. I lay in bed sometimes three or four hours a day and wait. I sip my coffee slowly and I listen to, to the guides talk to me. And you read my quotes. You read my quotes every day. And that's what comes from spirit. That's what comes from listening, not listening, not being stuck up in the ethers. Oh, up in here, up in here. Oh, I've been thinking, I've been thinking, I've been thinking. You think too much. What do you feel? Tell me what you feel. I want to know what you feel. I want to know how you feel. I want to know if you feel. I live in the four elements of my body, the four elements of, my, of the earth which are earth, water, fire, and air. The last one, heart, lungs, air. I love, I'm loved. Heart, lungs, air. I don't have capacity to love. I don't have capacity to be loved. Make a choice. Which is it? Do you love you? Because you can't love me unless you love you. Do you know how? Aho, shinawana, ho, nata. Aho, shinawana, hey. So that's enough out of me today. Uh, or, or the spirits, they, they speak through me. And um, they tell me what they want me to talk about. Uh, I don't, I, I guess I gave up my way of choice in that way. 
of what it is that I want to speak to quite some time ago. I didn't give up my choice with regards to loving me and how I love me and how I love you. But when the guides asked me to speak on a certain subject, I say yes. I gave up my rebellious, my rebellious nature in, uh, of that a long time ago when I stepped into my spiritual feet. Um, I hope everybody travels well this week and is safe in their travels and, uh, you know, is safe in their anger when somebody cuts them off, um, is safe uh, in their... Uh, uh, er, in their um, uh, uh, hurry to cut somebody off, else off to get to whatever it is they're not going. Uh, I'm here in Sedona uh, for the holidays, and I'm already seeing it. The lines from uh, Sedona proper all the way down the 179 into the village of Oak Creek. Uh, and what can you do? Everybody's in a hurry for a flurry. Anyways, my name is Walking Crow, and this is the trans... And this is a transformational sacred drum medicine. And if you're wanting to transform your life, if you're wanting to transcend your being, if you're wanting to trans transmute your soul and your way of living, reach out to me at area code 818-442-1717. 818-442-1717. Or walkingcrow at sacreddrummedicine.com. Walkingcrow at sacreddrummedicine.com. Dot com or reach out to me at sacred www.sacreddrummedicine.com aho aho Hey, walking crow, I am the transformational sacred drum medicine, embodied, incarnate. I am the I am that I say I am. Oh, you don't have a horse in this race. Have a beautiful, beautiful moon day, and we'll talk to you soon. Oh.